right, here we come. Oh uh, boy. Oh uh, boy. And. Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys a, another episode of Stormworks Build and Rescue, and yes folks, we're back once again, and today we're going to be doing something truly epic. So you can see this awesome helicarrier here, uh, we're going to probably try to land some aircraft on it, and we're going to have fun with this, but we're also going to have fun with those. Those are three anti-air missiles that you know we're going to be launching at this helicarrier. So. We're going to check this one out first, but stay tuned towards the end of the episode when we launch those missiles at it because I don't know what's going to happen. I'm hoping it explodes and catches on fire and it has some sort of epic crash, but I could be wrong. I mean, it might be able to withstand those missiles. So if you want to download these creations, I'll have them linked down in the description. The Helicarrier is by Razzle Gazzle, which I think I'm saying that right. It's kind of a strange name. And then the missiles are by Kepton. And also while you're down there, maybe hit that thumbs up button for some more Stormworks and let's do this. All right, here we are aboard the helicarrier. I'm not sure we're going to be able to land a plane on this, but I think we can definitely get a helicopter on this thing. So it looks like, wait, is that fuel for the, uh, the different planes and stuff? That's actually kind of cool. All right, let's open this up here. Uh, let's get up to the main cabin. You got firefighting equipment, which we're probably going to need that because there's going to be an epic fire. And let's go up to here. All right, let's turn on the lights. Oh, yes. All right, so let's go all lights on real quick. Uh, batteries are on. Starter is on. Uh, we're not getting anything to fire. Wait, oh, there it goes. It's a little delayed there. Okay, we've got the forward throttle. There's the heaters. So main RPS, let's go up. There we go. And then increase forward engines. All right, we are powering up here. Okay, oh, oh, uh-oh, uh-oh, okay. Are we good, everything, everything fine here? Oh, geez. Um, all right, we're up. I think we're good. Dude, that's awesome. Now, you're gonna notice the, uh, the sound's a little muffled. This pilot seat has a, uh, a headset on it. So, yeah, that's a thing. Hold on, let's go ahead do we want to have the forward engines on? Let's maybe decrease those real quick. So we'll kill those. That way we're just going to hover up. And let's just go straight up for now. By the way, there is a hangar in here too. So you can try to park some vehicles. Uh, does it work with like... Oh yeah, there is an elevator. So yeah, you can park it down in the hangar and take it up via elevator to the, uh, the main runway. Alright, let's go ahead and lift here. This thing lifts fast. Wow, that's remarkable looking. All right, let's go straight up, and then we can go forward here. It's got a GPS on it, so we are going to reposition this thing. All right, so we're probably ready to go ahead and increase the forward. There it goes. All right, so we've got that. And, yeah, it's stable. We can walk around on it, no problems. It actually doesn't lag, so I would say you could use this in multiplayer. So let's go ahead and set a GPS uh, location. Maybe we'll go over to the side of this island here. So what we're gonna do, let's go ahead and punch it in here. Okay, and then let's go altitude hold, let's say 200 here. So we're good to go. Let's go ahead and go autopilot on. And altitude hold, is that on? What's the remote control? Uh, I need to read a little bit more about this, huh? Let's get into the actual pilot. Actually, let's go down here while it's moving. I was going to say, let's get into the pilot seat and just sit here, but I want to stand on deck and, oh dear, it's twisting. So I'm thinking it's turning before it actually, oh, are we moving really fast or something? I can hardly walk forward right now. It feels like we're accelerating like crazy. Hold on, let's check the uh, photo mode real quick. Oh yeah, wow, we're carrying some speed there. And it's climbing. All right, so it's getting up to the 200. Uh, it should stabilize here in a second. There it goes. Okay, so we got that. Uh, there's some supplies there. If I can get down towards this, I'm... Oh, that's the problem. I'm floating for some reason. Uh, yep, I've got my hands up like I don't care. I might have to actually no-clip this right now. Hold on, let's go ahead and no-clip. There we go. All right, so it is traveling. Oh, 200 might have been a little too high. So yeah, let's go ahead and look at it real quick. You've got some doors that lead you out to the sides here. Uh, I don't know what that shaking is. I think it might be the camera. 
I'm actually afraid to like jump down on this because I feel like I might fly off it. Here's the hangar. There's a code here, which I think it's one, two, three, four. What does that do? Hold on, let's get in here. Oh, that was almost a mistake. All right, we can walk around in here. Hold on, this is, oh, it's the engine room. So let's go one, uh, one, two, three, four. Uh, we get, oh, is there an enter? Is this enter? Oh, there it goes. That's a cool little uh, key code thing. I've never seen one of those before. All right, so yeah, this just uh, is the batteries and stuff. All right, so yeah, this is just engine room. Cool little uh, passcode system, though. I like that. All right, let's uh, take the elevator up real quick. Why do I feel like the elevator might already be up? Hold on, what is this? Uh, close? What do we? What do we close? Oh, this is the uh, the hangar door back here. All right, let's leave that closed. Can I call the elevator down from here? I feel like I can. Oh, here it is. All right, so it is, let's go ahead and reset it. Let's go down. There we go. So we can grab something and we can go right back up, which is pretty cool here. So let's do that and let's go up. There we go. So yeah, uh, there's not a whole bunch inside of it. And I think that's what's helping it lag wise because it really doesn't lag that much. Dude, I just now noticed all the supplies here. This is ridiculous. All right, let's get on this parachute. And what is this over here? All right, so this is fueling. So yeah, very awesome craft here. We're gonna go fly back over the, uh, or at least near the creative island. I'd like to land something on this before we uh, obliterate it. All right, we're gonna reset the altitude hold. Let's go to 100. And let's shift this over here. So let's go. Oh, I, that's remote control. Yeah, we need to play with remote control things. Uh, we haven't done that yet in Stormworks, but that's something they've added. They have like a little controller. Uh, pretty cool looking. Okay, so let's jump down and grab ourselves an aircraft. We'll hop off this. There we go. Wait for it. Oh, that's so awesome looking. All right, let's get our parachute out. So yeah, I think we're going to take a helicopter up there and just land it on it. I would try a plane, but... I mean, there is quite a bit of runway, but I don't know if I have a small enough plane to be able to do that. So I told you guys how I was going to try to land a helicopter on there. I decided to go with an F-18. This is fine. We're totally going to die here. All right, so I got to figure out how to crank this bad boy up real quick. It's going to go throttle up, battery on. Okay, sounds like it's firing up. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing here. Are the wings folded? No, they're not. All right, canopy, nav light. Uh, we're already taking off. We're good to go. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. This might have been a mistake. Oh, apparently it wasn't a mistake. Holy man, this is fast. Uh, the bomb that was on the bottom, is that even a bomb? Is that a drop tank? No, that looks like a bomb. Uh, we might have screwed something up here, but we're totally going to be able to land here. Oh, boy. Okay, come around. Okay, look for the helicarrier. We need to slow down here. By the way, we can uh, shoot some weapons at it. That would be a thing, wouldn't it? Oh, uh, boy. Oh, we're coming in way too fast. This is fine. Okay, let's see. Do we want to shoot a weapon at it? Oh, let's fly under it. Oh, it's so cool looking. Okay, so... I kind of want to fire something. Oh, no. Oh, no. That might have been a mistake. It's fine. Wait, did we just do that? How did that not explode the engines? Uh, we're gonna ignore that even happened. No, no, we're fine. All right, let's uh, fly back up there. You know what? We're gonna attempt to just land this because we have missiles on the ground. Okay, we're cutting back on the throttle. We're totally not gonna make this. Uh, it's kind of hard for me to tell like how powered up this plane is right now. Uh, the headsets are cool, but they do deafen the sound quite a bit. So now I'm a little confused. All right, so it's definitely going down. Uh, can I turn the headset off? Oh dear. Oh no, no, no. Okay, we almost just ran right into that it's fine all right we need to be a little bit more level with the, the actual helicarrier here all right so we have a little bit of an issue the helicarrier is in the middle of a cloud right now i can't see it like it's right there in front of us i'll huh? start to back off this is gonna be a mistake uh do i see anything off of it where the heck is it uh oh there it is look at that it's in the middle of a cloud how am I supposed to be able to see this game? You spawned a cloud right in on the helicarrier. So yeah, landing a helicopter on this would totally be easy mode and very possible, but this, this is something on oh, kill it. Oh dear. Okay, we just want to touch it. Can we just touch the helicarrier? We're in a cloud right now. 
So if I pop out of this, yep, the helicarrier disappears. This cloud really needs to move. Hey, looking for it, looking for it. It's got to be like right here. Oh, geez. Oh, okay. Um, do we have an ejection seat in this? Oh, we've broken something. Okay, wait, can we save it? Save it? Oh, we're in like an endless spin. Hold on. Okay, I just saved it. So this uh, F-16 can take a beating. All right, here we come. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. And... Oh! <laughs> oh, no! Okay, we might have knocked the F-16 out that time. Uh, let's go ahead and... Uh, canopy? Uh, do I have a parachute on right now? I don't think I do. I think I have to reset the whole mission because this thing being in the middle of a cloud is not good. What is that? Uh, oh, on, on parachute, 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 par Okay, we died. Where's the helicarrier at? Is it still behind the one pesky cloud? So, yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to actually fly a, a plane on it. Helicopter would be easy. Plane, not so much. There's the helicarrier. Okay, so it's exposed again. All right, so let's go ahead and work this thing. So, how... Okay, hop, hop into here. So we got, like, a fire the missile and all that other good stuff. How do we actually work this? Do we just aim this at it and it's good to go? That's a good question, huh? Turn. All right, where'd the helicarrier... Wait. Yeah, it's locking onto it. You gotta be kidding me. That's cool. Okay. Uh... On. Do we have a lock? Where's... Is it seriously in the cloud again? This is the most annoying cloud I've ever seen in Stormworks. Why won't you just pass? Ugh. You know, for funsies, we're gonna fire this one off. Three, two, one, fire. Right. Oh, and we just hit the top of the hangar. Where's it going? Uh, all right, we might've made a bad there. Also, there's other versions of this missile. There's actually one that targets ships I'd like to try out. By the way, I found the remote control unit. It's down here, so if we wanna actually do this from the ground. So if I were to pick this up and then we just turn this on, are we good? Oh, am I controlling this? Uh, let's see, toggle control. Uh, oh, oh. Uh, are you serious? Are we controlling this thing? Uh, I think we are. That, that's kind of ridiculous that you can do that. All right, so we're going to go ahead and set this waypoint real quick. Let's go 30. Okay, boom. Autopilot is now back on, so it's going to get into position. Now we're ready to shoot those missiles at it. Uh, we might want to hop off this bad boy. It's about to get kind of ugly. Now, if we hit it, which I don't know what it's going to target. Is it going to target the engines, or what's it going to do here? Uh, that's a good question. All right, this thing should be moving away. It's not really moving very fast. Uh, do I not have the altitude hold set right? It's about to crash into the hangar, by the way. Uh-oh. Well, let's get on here and try to reset this real quick. All right, helicarrier's up. Let's go ahead and hop back into here. All right, let's go up. Okay, I'm listening for the beeping. It's beeping right now let's hit the brakes real quick all right so is it good to go oh, let's try uh, just firing it here three two one fire there it goes it's curving and oh it curved away is it is it turning around uh it's a good question huh i'm gonna read the instructions one more time that missile might be turning around all right, there shouldn't be much to this. Is that the missile falling out of the sky? I think it actually ran out of steam there. All right, so let's hit the brakes here. All right, so we sh should be good to go here. All right, let's go up. I'm hearing it beeping. All right, three, two, one, fire. There it goes. And... Oh, it just curved a mist. Okay. Okay, so that's two misses there. I feel like there's a potential that I'm a little too close. So it's not having enough time to actually get up and turn. So I'm going to back up really far on this one. And the helicarrier is slowly moving away. I'm hoping this is going to work here. Oh, hit the brakes. Okay, that awkward moment when he backed up too far on. Hit it. Oh, it's turning and it curved. What the? They all seem to be curving to the side. Oh, geez. And I'm in the water. All right. So I think I need to get another one. We're going to have to do this until it works. Folks, I've got missiles for days. All right, so let's go up here. Okay, so it's beeping. All right, so is it tracking right now? Uh, let's try to fire from back here. Three, two, one, fire. Okay, is it going to curve to the left side again? Or... Oh, there it goes. Okay, so it struck it that time. 
And it's going that way. Uh, it scratched the helicarrier. Why do I feel like maybe this missile isn't powerful enough to take it down? How do you take down a helicarrier? Okay, we're going to move to something bigger. Okay, so I'm back on the F-16 train here. I think this is actually what we're going to need to use in order for this to work. All right, so it's powering up. Okay, parking brake release. All right. Uh, should be good to go. Master arms on. All right. Let's go ahead and pull out here. Try to avoid the uh, little missile carrier. Okay. And here we go. So we weren't armed last time. So yeah, this is going to be probably our best option to take this bad boy out. Okay, so what weapon do we have selected right now? I'm not even really sure. Oh, let's make sure we're aimed the right way. We're totally about to crash. All right. Come up. Come up. All right, here we go. Let's see what we've got here. We're going to turn around. We're going to see if we can hit these. All right, let's see if we have anything equipped here. So if I hit shoot here, there it goes. There goes the missiles. Okay, those are somewhat guided. Oh, geez. Oh, okay. It's fine. Oh, we just shoved a couple missiles up in it right now. I don't know if you could take this helicarrier down. Like, what's up with the engines? Uh, yeah, there's not a very good chance of us hitting that. I mean, we just ran an F-16 into it, and we still don't have anything. Uh, that's a thing. By the way, this is an awkward spot to be stuck in. I'm going to throttle up real quick, and let's see if we can tip this thing. I'd love to be able to take down this helicarrier, but I, I think it's pretty much invincible. Okay, this is fine. Can we just open up the canopy? Let's... Oh, I can't even open that. All right, let's get out, and we're going to no-clip into the, uh, the helicarrier right now. So, yeah... Missiles? No. I mean, uh, if you hit it directly on the engine, even if you take down one engine, I'm not sure this thing's going to come crashing down. Like, I figured we could at least light it on fire. All right, so say if this thing was going down, we can at least test this. There is an emergency landing procedure. So let's go emergency landing and click these. What does that do? I want to say this deploys maybe parachutes. Oh, look at that. Uh-oh. Um, I hope it deploys more parachutes than that. Uh, so it deploys them on one side. Oh, where'd they go? Oh, I guess they're actually still good. Hold on, kill the starter. Battery's off. Can we get this thing to crash into the ocean at least? No, it's still throttled up. We need to throttle this down real quick. Okay, engines are killed here. At least some of the forward ones are. No, this thing's not going anywhere. So by the way, the plane's still holding it up somewhat. I think we've broken something in Stormworks. Not sure what we've learned here today. I think we've learned the helicarrier here is really, really pretty much invincible. Uh, we've got damage on it, but nothing's taking it down. We're going to crash it into the side of the mountain here. And, oh, there go the emergency parachutes. Okay, it took a little bit for those to come out. And I think it's just going to softly land on the side here. Can we at least get it to burst into flames? Nope, we just bounced off that. Yeah. Okay, well, I think we've proved it. Helicarrier is uh, really, really strong. But anyways, I think it's going to wrap it up for this episode. Thank you guys for all the love and support on the series. You guys are amazing. And we will see you guys next time on Stormworks.